Welcome everybody to another special edition of Mixology Monday. I'm Dave, this is Disney Fornia where you can find food reviews, rides, and more. Let's do this. Tonight's drink comes from a special friend, Sally, who let me know about this drink called Call Me A Cab. That reminds me of the really cool cab from Who Framed Roger Rabbit, Benny the Cab. I love that ride where you can go into Toontown and control Benny and spin him around. And it's basically like teacups meets dark ride. It's a blast if you haven't been on that ride. That was like the first thing that just popped in my brain. I was like, I have to do this. This is gonna be awesome. So tonight's drink, Call Me A Cab, and here is the ingredients. A red Cabernet, vodka, and lemonade. That's it. Those three things are gonna make this really amazing, refreshing drink. First, grab yourself a really awesome glass. Like, not just one of those wine glasses, but I'm talking something that can hold a lot of liquid. First, pour in your ice cubes. Then, you're gonna pour in one ounce of vodka. You can have any choice that you want. I chose to go with absolute vodka. Next, you're gonna pour in six ounces of lemonade. We're gonna stop there for a second. I didn't just use any lemonade. I used freshly squeezed lemonade. Lemonade, and I'm telling you, the fresher, the better. I used six lemons in order to get six ounces of lemon juice. Then I put in six ounces of water. So basically one part lemon juice, one part water. Then I put in a half a cup of sugar. Now typically you would probably use a full cup of sugar, but since I was using Myers lemons, which has a more sweeter taste to it, I only used half the sugar. Now let me tell you a little hint my wife gave me on how to get the juice out of the lemon. You might think to yourself, that that's easy. This is super easy. All you have to do is get yourself a skewer, place it at the base of the lemon, and stick it in. Not all the way through, just halfway through the lemon. Next, what you're gonna do is just squeeze out the juice. It's that simple. I'm telling you, I am mind blown right now. I'm so thankful that my wife gave me that tip. And then take six ounces of the lemonade and pour it into the drink. You're almost through, friends. We've got the vodka and we've got the lemonade. The last ingredient here is the red wine. And this is where it gets the name, call me a cab. Uncork that wine and just pour it in nice and easy, all the way up to the top or however much you desire. And that is it, you got yourself, call me a cab. Nice refreshing, especially as these days are getting a lot warmer. Cheers. So thanks again for Sally for telling me about Call Me A Cab and for giving me this bottle of wine. That was so sweet. Thank you so much, Sally. Hey, I wanna let you guys know about one more dessert. It's called the Chocolate Cherry Red Wine Ice Cream. It's super easy and super delicious. Since we're already talking about red wines, let's add one more in the mix, right? So first, all you have to do is just get your red wine, which you already had from the previous drink, and then get yourself any type of ice cream you like. I chose the Talenti Dark Chocolate Cherry for mine, and it looks delicious. I am a sweet tooth, so this chocolate cherry, those are like two of my favorite things things right there, all in an ice cream form. I'm getting excited about this. We need to do this. First, what you're gonna do is take a dish and then you're going to scoop in a large amount of ice cream. Really, you put in the amount of ice cream that you want. I like a lot. 
So that's why I'm putting a lot. Then what you do is you just pour over the red wine. And that is it, friends. That makes the chocolate cherry red wine ice cream yum. Thanks guys so much for watching. Drop a comment down below. Let me know if there's a favorite drink that you enjoy or if you enjoyed what you watch. Thanks guys.